that I'll be speaking and informing you about environments such as parents, teacher, and society and how it impacts children's development. From the moment we are born, we rely and look up towards what is around us. A child needs support of a parent from an early period of life. Any negative or positive, positive interaction, interactions will be favorable to a child's development, including in problems, so, in problem solving, high self-esteem, social school behavior, and closer friendships and better peer relationships. In the book Awakening Children's Minds, how parents and teachers can make a difference by Berkmore E. Quotes. In the some high quality involvement with children requires a certain quality of time and actually a great deal. Parents' actions towards the children will affect their life socially and personally. Personally in the future, that's me saying we need to spend more time with our children, show more affection, and still like their wants. <laughs> children start learning at months old. And this chart of milestones of early literacy development by Reach Out and Read program shows where children are learning from six months to five years, which is basically our childhood. For example, at six months, they start talking, making eye contact, and expressing emotions. They start noticing what is around them and start copying, which is why it's important for a child to have a healthy and safe environment. From my experience studying early child education, I can confirm with children that children do copy and learn what they see in their environment. And as a child, they don't really know what is wrong, right? For example, someone can tell them something is right when it's actually wrong, or vice versa. In the book Environment and Children by Christopher Day speaks how the environment is designed by an adult. Quoting, adults need to create a welcoming and safe place because the environment influences what path a child will choose in the future. For example, maybe they hope the home they have will encourage them to want to live far away because they're treated badly and will want a better future and not treat the children that way. Or maybe they have a perfect home and will want to maintain their life the same way and maintain that um, culture or like the way they're being taught to their future children. A child needs to feel encouraged, supported, understanding in their environment. Their, their safe place could be either at school, home, and friends, which could be at the society. Social relationships and places such as classrooms or playgrounds is places children could also get influenced by a lot of Oh, there's actually teenagers there at playgrounds and like classrooms and can uh, get influenced wrong things. In the book, Play Equals Learning, how play motivates and enhances children's cognitive and social emotional growth by Oxford University Press says, a teacher sets rules and has the responsibility of, ex of expanding the learning development of a child. In school, a child can get bullied unfortunately in society it could co can cause trauma in, in their development but that's why a child needs to feel welcome in their environment of school by a teacher or by an adult and feel they can express their emotions and know they will receive a receive help but society and environment affects the future and the mentality of a child as they grow children have different opportunities opportunities in their development, given by personal attributes, physical or mental, or by social environment in which they live in. I know myself in life and what is, or what is around me or what was around me, whether it was my parents, teacher, friends, or society, maybe who I am, which is probably will do the same for many and for you. As for example, my life, I was brought up from a Mohawkin culture and maybe who I am today or like what we experienced as children made us who we are today. Overall environment and what surrounds children will affect a children's de child's development growth. As adults, we have the responsibility to help a child feel safe and wanted in any environment. There will always be a child in our life, such as our cousins, nephews, or a student, because I want to be a teacher. We have the responsibility in this society as and this new generation to keep them, like make, make them want, feel wanted and feel safe so they can have a better future and like not turn out.
bad kids, like not bad kids, but yeah, I don't know. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to say? Okay, thank you.